Hi there everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to access the secret diagnostic mode on your iPhone 5S or newer. This can work for the old iPhone 5S from 2013 and it can go all the way up to the latest iPhone 16 series. And this can work for any types of devices from iOS that can run like iOS 11 all the way up to the latest iOS 18. Um, it can work for any iOS 11 device that still isn't supported, but it can be an older device that wasn't released when iOS 11 came out. But if it was upgraded to iOS 11, then you can be able to do this. And also, you will need to hold down a button combination, but if you have a device with Face ID, it won't work for iPads, you will need to hold down a different combination. So for iPhones with Touch ID, plug in the device while holding down the volume up button and the home button. So simply hold down those two buttons and while holding them, plug in the charger and keep holding them until you see the diagnostics menu. And for iPhones with Face ID, you can simply hold down both of the volume buttons and while holding them, you can plug in the charger and make sure to keep holding the buttons until you see the diagnostic menu. So you should keep holding down these buttons until you see the Apple logo, that's fine, just keep holding them and you can let go of the buttons when you see the diagnostics page. So now I'm going to like pause the video and I'll resume it once I get to the diagnostics page because that's the main part of the video. After a while of holding down those buttons, we now got the diagnostics page. So it says diagnostics allow Apple to identify potential hardware and software issues with this device. So if you want to change the language, tap on this globe icon and we're not going to exit diagnostics, just tap on start diagnostics. And when you tap on start, it will ask for your internet connection. Let me just go and click on start. And I'm covering this because it has my network credentials. So it says choose a Wi-Fi network, simply choose your network on the list and enter the password for it. And once you're done, you can simply tap on join. Now, once your network is connected, it will now connect to Apple support. And we got this message. So unfortunately, it doesn't work for my iPhone SE since it's a little too old. But you can always take your device to uh, Apple support or call them or you can go for an online chat or you can visit their website if you want over here, if you would like to fix any issues that you have with your device. But if you do get this screen, that's fine. Just simply tap on exit diagnostics and it says this will end your diagnostic session with Apple support. So we'll just tap exit diagnostics and we will now conclude the video. So thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe for more videos. And also please share this video if you found anything interesting or anything funny. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.